This is an overview of the core features included in IPEX 1. The Calls tab can be accessed from the left-hand side of the main menu. The first section of the Tools tab is the Call Log. Here you can see your call history, including any calls that you've missed, as well as calls that you have made or received. If you want to return a call, you can do so by pressing the telephone symbol, or for more options, you can press the three dots. Here you can set up a video call with an internal contact. Go to the chat window, see more details about the call or delete the call log. You can also filter the call log to only show missed calls using the Missed Calls tab at the top. On the right hand side of this screen is the dial pad. You can also access the dial pad from the icon with nine dots in the top right of the screen, which you can access from either the home screen, the contact screen, the call screen or the chat screen. Next to the dial pad, you also have options to access your voicemail, to pick up a call from a pickup group, to pick up a parked call, and also to intrude on another extension's existing call. To make a call from the dial pad, dial the number that you want to call and press the green call icon. If this number is already assigned to a contact, their details will appear. If you want to make a call to a contact, you can search that contact by the name. In this case, we will search for Ed. You can then choose if you want to call Ed's extension number or his office number. Now we will make a call to Mark by searching for his contact, choosing the office number and clicking the telephone icon. If this was an internal contact in our organisation, you could initiate a video call here by clicking the video icon. From within a call you can see the duration of the call, the number that you're calling and you can also mute the call, put the call on hold or transfer the call. Click the three dots to see more options, including the keypad. If you needed to choose options while on the call, call recording, call parking and if you are making an internal call, you can switch to video. If you want to transfer the call, you can do so by clicking on the transfer key and searching for the contact you wish to transfer to, in this case Tom. If you want to make a blind transfer, meaning the call goes straight through to the recipient of the transfer, then tick the blind transfer box. Once connected, you can let the contact know that there is a call for them and hang up to complete the transfer. This completes our basic call handling demonstration of IPEX 1.